Most BCS tractors come equipped with a forward reverse lever on the right-hand controls. Those models with a differential lockout will have an additional lever just to the left of this lever. If you are working on a tractor with both levers and find yourself needing to reassemble them, this is the process. You will need the following tools. A 17mm socket or wrench, and some medium thread locker. Verify that you have all components to reassemble the forward reverse lever. You should have a pin, a spring, a fork, two bushings, and two small plates. If you are reusing the pin, examine it for damaged or compromised threads on either side. If reusing any bushings, examine the internal threads of these as well. Notice that the placement of the threaded part of the pin is not directly in the center, but offset. Insert this through the hexagonal hole in the support bracket, with the threaded portion at the bottom. Now, assemble the forward reverse lever. Position the fork like so, with the lever against the interior left side. Compress the spring with your fingers and slide it into place at the lower end of the fork. From the right, insert the bushing through the lower hole of the fork, the spring, the forward reverse lever, and out the other side of the fork. Insert the longer, grooved end of the cable anchor through the upper hole of the fork, the lever, and out through the other side of the fork. Install the small plate so the slotted hole goes over the groove in the cable anchor. Then position the lower round hole with the lower hole of the fork, hold it in place, and apply pressure to the bushing until it fits into place. Now take your differential lockout lever and slide the longer grooved end of this cable anchor through the front hole of the lever. Position the small plate so the slotted hole slides over the groove of the cable anchor and position the lower round hole of the plate over the lower hole in the lever. Pass the bushing through the other side of this hole, through the plate, and hold in place. Apply a small amount of medium thread locker to the pin on this side. Hold the pin firmly in place from the other side and turn the bushing clockwise to tighten by hand. Then, using a 17mm socket or wrench, tighten to approximately 15 foot-pounds. Apply a small amount of medium thread locker to the other side of the pin and slide the lever assembly over it. Holding the pin firmly in place, turn the bushing clockwise to tighten by hand. Then, using a 17mm socket or wrench, tighten to approximately 15 foot-pounds. Verify that both levers are working properly, and you are done. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button below and subscribe to our channel for more. To contact us about the content of this video, please call 1-800-543-1040 or email info at bcsamerica.com. Thank you.